Yo, what's up guys? I am uh, Osrin. I don't really know what to name my YouTube channel yet. I could name it whatever I want. Uh, I just wanted to make this video <coughs> to show you my first moto vlog. And so hopefully, you know, you guys like it. So, what I will be talking about today is my motorcycle. I have an Iron 883 Harley Davidson and I had it for about three months. So this thing's pretty badass. I like it. And uh, this is actually my first bike. The first bike I've ever ridden on, ever. So it's pretty exciting, you know? And uh, I could say, you know, I feel like I'm already an experienced rider. To be honest, look, I could do, I could ride with just one hand. That's very dangerous. What? I'm getting a little risky. Oh, two hands. Oh my God. What is the matter with me? No, don't do that. That's stupid. I was only going like 15 miles an hour and I was, that was dumb. Anyways, yeah, this is my Iron 883. I've had it for three months and oh, hey. Oh, no, no, anyways, had it for three months, and it's pretty fun. I like it. It's freaking badass. It's got a classic style to it. It's, uh, <laughs> it's real dope. You know, it's, it's caught, it's, it catches people's attention. People like it. And, uh, you know, it's cool. I've always wanted a motorcycle since I was in high school, and I was fortunate enough to, uh, the wow, cool! First rider, first motor vlogger. I mean, ugh, first motorcycle guy I spotted while vlogging. That's exciting, yeah. Uh, what was I talking about? Oh yeah, I've always wanted a motorcycle when I was in high school. Unfortunately, I wasn't able to get it because I was young, and I was thinking, I was thinking speed. You know, every young kid thinks of speed when he's young and dumb and full of <coughs> and, and full of, uh, let's not say that. Anyways, yeah, so uh, I had recently sold my Camaro. That was a graduation gift from my mother. Uh, it's really sad. You know, I really like that car, but it was going nowhere. So I got this Iron 883 and yeah now i could now i could go to work and shit and school you know i really needed it so yeah anyways it was a pretty good option you know the other option was a, a forerunner i really wanted a forerunner but that that there was a uh, yeah it was too expensive the one that i was looking at you know i'm i like i like getting <laughs> pricey shit but you know i can't afford it so Anyways, I really wanted a motorcycle. I saw the opportunity and I went ahead and got it. So yeah, this is it right here. Right now I need to go put some gas. I need to fill her, fill her up. Fill her up though. I gotta fill her up. Fill her up with that V power. That V power, all right, here we go. Ooh. Your own. Alrighty. Cut engine. Kickstand. Oh yeah. Alright. I'm gonna go ahead and show you on my bike. This is it right here. I named her Mercy. I named her Mercy because I wanted a girl name. And my favorite movie is The Warriors. And I liked uh the character Mercy. She was pretty sh fucking badass, and just like this motorcycle, you know, they're badass. Yeah. So, yeah, man. Pretty cool bike. Alright, we are back, and we are live. Alright. <laughs> just, just fueled her up. Now she should be turning not amber low fuel icon 
There we go. Ooh, now let's see. Where do I want to ride to? I hope I'm not forgetting anything. Okay, I put my wallet in the backpack and fuel caps on. All right, good check. Yeah, you know what? I'm not trying to fuck with that freaking bullshit traffic right there. Maybe I should go back around. Ooh. Oh, hey, look at that. Is that an El Camino? Sure is. <coughs> yeah, let me look. I want to do a little review of the bike because I feel like that's every motor vlogger's thing to do. So I want to go ahead and give you my opinion on the bike since I put just over, I want to say, hold on, let's see. Okay, I have, let me switch through my thing. I just missed it. I have 1,500 miles on this bike now. Bought it brand new. So the first thing I want to talk about is the styling. Uh, it's very classic. I like the way it looks. To me, it looks classic. It almost, I was kind of going for the vintage style and it <coughs> and it's pretty, it's pretty close there. I really wanted the Roadster, but the Roadster's expensive. So I'm really looking into getting that maybe the end of this year. But anyways, with the bike, okay, styling's great. Uh, suspension feels good. And it's, it's a little, it's a little stiff, but you could adjust it. You could adjust it with the, the tools that it provides you underneath the seat. I don't know how to fuck with that though, so. I'm not even gonna try, you know, it's it's pretty good now. And like, oh look, there's that guy. Anyways, uh, <laughs> it's pretty good. <laughs> I ain't gonna fuck with any of the, me the mechanics of it. You know, this is just gonna be, I'm gonna leave it completely stocked because at the end of this year, I'm gonna get that Roadster. I'm gonna get that freaking Roadster. And so, okay, it looks great. The ride's good. You know, people say it's underpowered. I think it has, I think it has great power. Me being the, this being my first motorcycle, I thought this thing had a lot of power. And so, well not a lot, I mean, I knew it was a small engine, but you know, for it being my first time, I was like, wow, this is how they feel? Like, it's, it's pretty cool. Anyways, but yeah, you hear that squeaky noise? That's one thing I have a problem with. I mean, it's not that bad. When I had first got it, maybe 200 miles in, I started hearing, well, I think actually when I had first started riding it, maybe under 100 miles in, I started hearing squeaking on the brakes, the front and back. And so I was like, damn, that sucks. You know, I, I, this is a new bike. Why is it doing that? And I was freaking out. I took it. I even talked to the guy I had bought it from at Harley. And he, uh, he said, it's fine. It's just... It just needs to be breaking in. It's a new bike, new brakes. And so I was just freaking out. I mean, it, it's cool. I mean, you hear it every now and then, but it wasn't as bad as it was before. But yeah, from what I hear, it's totally normal. So don't even worry about that. And yeah. So styling's great. Power, power's good for a beginner. And uh, yeah, it even sounds like a Harley. I love that. It's badass. Oh shit, it's the Popo. Oh shit, son. Oh shit. Oh, she's on a walkie. Who are you call who are you talking to? Another police boy? A policeman? Who? Hmm? Who? Hmm? Oh, is that your policeman boyfriend over there? Well <coughs> Another thing too about this bike is that you you should really avoid uh these speed bumps. Uh, you're not supposed. Oh, I mean, you, you're never supposed to avoid speed bumps. Bunks. You're never supposed to. Okay, <laughs> I say avoid speed bumps because the the clearance on this is kind of low. <clears throat> the ground clearance is kind of low, and you know you can't you can't go through all speed bumps. I went to uh, there's this park here in San Antonio called Phil Hardberger Park, and that was a uh, <clears throat> it was bad. It was bad because they had a really big, tall speed bump, and I freaking hit the undercarriage of the bike, and oh, it sounded so ugly, and I looked so stupid in front of all these MILFs that were walking around during the day. I was like, man, fuck. <sighs> no, I wasn't tripping, but yeah, just careful on, uh, 
like speed bumps like that if there's if there's just you know a single speed bump and there's no gap in the middle just uh, watch out for that that's all I gotta say if you have a if you're looking to get an iron 883 oh this is crazy I'm doing a little review uh, okay it's not crazy but it, you know it's cool so far I think I'm doing all right hey uh, officer I don't got a stop sign haha huh? you do but you run it you ran you run the stop you had run the stop sign you know that? You're not supposed to do that. You get a ticket. But uh, yeah, anyways, okay, like, let me, okay, this is stupid. I'm not gonna, I was gonna pull up over here at Walmart, but it's like so <coughs> lame. <laughs> it's so lame. I'm not gonna do it there. I'm just gonna pull up over here somewhere. Hi. Hi, sign lady. Yeah, you spin that sign, girl. You spin it. Oh shit, I was about to go. Cock. Alright, hold on, just a sec. Just gotta wait for this Chevy Silverado to come through. Oh, you like that? Oh, I'm gonna go this way. Yeah, I get real nervous going over speed bumps because of that issue I had at Phil Harburger Park. I mean, that, that was really scary. Because I lost balance and I thought I was gonna drop the bike and I didn't want that to happen. Another thing, okay. Alright, uh... <laughs> I love doing um, accents. I'm not good at them, but I love doing them because it's funny. It's just funny to talk in a different accent. Well, actually, I, I, I shouldn't say it's funny. I just admire it. I really like the English accent. I really do like the English accent. And from what I hear, from what, when I hear from other people, when I talk to them in that accent, they're like, "Hey, you, that that almost sound that almost sounded realistic. Like that's pretty good." And I'm like, "Hey, man, thanks." And uh, yeah. So, uh, if I do more of these video vlogs, motor vlogs, then you will, you will see me, uh, talk, you will hear me talk in an English accent, sometimes, just sometimes, you know, it just, it just comes up spontaneously, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, but, yeah, that's, that should be it for my motor vlog. Oh, oh, look at all that crap, oh, 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 skit, skit, skit. Ah! I was trying to do a burnout, but I was kind of a little bitch and I didn't want to do it, so... Yeah, that's my fault. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh, oh. I'm just kidding. It wasn't even that bad. I wasn't even tripping, man. I wasn't even fucking tripping, dude! What the hell, man? I wasn't tripping, guys! <coughs> oh, it's such a pain in the ass to have this fucking cough! It really is. Yeah, but... Hopefully, I hope to bring y'all great videos um, in the near future. Uh, this is just like a little. This is an experience, I think, for me. I, I wanted to. I wanted to do this motor vlogging so I could see how I am, like how I am on footage. You know, just as like myself. You know, me me recording myself right now is uh, is pretty much how I am with my friends like uh, I'm just there's there's an unfiltered version and when I'm by myself like I am now obviously uh, I just speak whatever's in my head and so I've noticed that while writing and I'm like you know what I want to give it a shot I want to try moto vlogging you know what I want to say uh, whatever I have to say you know that I say to myself and I want to get it on on video and so, well, we'll see how it goes. You know, because uh, I had a... I was going to work, and, you know, there's <laughs> there just a bunch of funny stuff I see. And it's like, wow, that'd be good. That'd be so cool to record it. And, well, yeah, I just, like, invested in the mic. I had my GoPro, and, uh... <coughs> and I uh, kind of made some holes in my helmet. So I can mount my GoPro, which was dumb, but you know, I'm just trying to get the the best view I can. I mean, it looks good, right? I mean, can y'all agree? Like my video, the video, like it's I, I think it's straight. Like I'm pretty, it's pretty. So uh, I kind of just went to went from day. I went from <laughs> I just went from day to night view, and uh, that's because my battery had ran out. So, to end the video, uh, I wanted to say that uh, every every month, there's a, a sport bike 
meetup. Last month's sport bike uh, meet was pretty cool. It's at uh, Dave & Buster's on I-10, which is just on the other side over here. We just passed it, but it's on I-10, I-10, 410, and a bunch of bikes show up, and it's pretty neat. What I'm going to do uh, this month is I'm going to live stream it through a Periscope app, and then afterwards, I'm going to... Well, well, also during the live stream, I'm going to go ahead and uh, record through my GoPro and show y'all on a better quality how it looks, you know, edit it, make it look fun, probably throw some music in the background. I hope you guys like the video. Uh, if you're looking forward to more, just go ahead and subscribe. And uh, if you want, you can give me some pointers. Let me know what y'all want to see. And... Uh, yeah, go ahead and comment me. Comment, message, whatever. I'm down for it. <clears throat> so, alright, uh, deuce.